Hello, my pretties. I'm here to do a read for Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rise, and Venus. Um, if you're looking for any information about me, it's going to be in the description box below. The prettyoracle.com is where you're going to find um, a bunch of items that I have to offer you guys. Um, first, you have to click products when you get to the site. And um, you do not need PayPal to purchase anything from me. You're just going to click that option and put in any credit or debit card that you do have. So, Gemini. I heard, I got my mind set on you. I got my mind set on you. Spirit wants you to keep your mind set on um, your creative endeavors, okay? Don't lose out or miss out on, um, on your path. We have the honoring path and your higher self. Somebody um, has been working on their heart chakra or working on healing. Um, I do feel like... Um, Somebody just may got a heart locket or something like that. If a, 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 a lot of energy of the heart. I want to find out because I'm looking at this where it says creative endeavor and loss. Okay? Creative endeavor and loss. Some of you guys are going to be creating out of a tragedy. Right? Like So if something negative has happened to you, it's either you're going to teach about it, write about it, make a song about it, um, create, um, come through with and produce some type of um project that has to do with um you know your losses also i, I wanted to say um or your tragedy also i wanted to say yes um to, to go ahead and sit on your throne somebody's going to be a celebrity yeah you know i i can make you a celebrity overnight somebody's going to be a celebrity literally with the page of pentacles um, shine like the star that you are, but see the thing about that is, um, for some of you guys, you need to have, mm, I, I don't want to say you need to have patience cause it, it doesn't feel like it feels like you're not taking action fast enough, quick enough, self being self-assured and reference to whatever this is and you have to do it. Okay. With the lottery energy here, it says bet on yourself, bet on yourself because the three of wands is in reverse. It's like some of you guys may be feeling like there's no hope for this situation. Like, yeah, I know that this is what I want to do and what I want to be with the honor and path here, but it's like, you don't really see how it's going to happen. Okay, you're you're being called to tap into your higher wisdom. Um, there's some downloads that you need to go out there and grab. You could uh do some meditation, okay? Because there's some goodness that wants to come to you, some positive energy, prosperous. I, like I said, right here you see this lady receiving. Can y'all see that? This lady's receiving some sort of accolade. Yeah, but there's 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 a need to okay before you get to this energy right the honoring path. There's a need to release some things, all right? I, I want to find out, you know, for you guys what exactly that is. Um, but it looks like it's kind of standing in the way. And then I get a, um, yeah, things that happen to you that are negative, um, you know, and, and there's a need to not look back in the, into the past and recover, okay? With the, with the star in reverse, it's making me feel like something may have hurt you a little bit too much. Okay, and your heart chakra may need to heal. Okay, so that's why we have this heart energy here. Tell me about how the star is reversed. Why is the star in reverse? Yeah, you guys have to connect. Um, to your inner voice like I said go and grab those downloads and connect to your guides because I feel like there's some sort of um information about how you need to move forward and move on but I feel that there's a there's, there's confusion here there's confusion here that's about it. The confusion is putting something to rest, leaving something behind so that you can go forward and receive like whatever award or accolade this is. Um, some of you guys are not um, trusting in the divine, like, you know, or, or as far as, you know, how things are going to transpire. It's like 
something is stressing you out in reference to how this is going to happen. Yeah, I know, you know, this is what I want, but how? How is it going to happen? And, and, and trying to find out how, it's like you're not moving your feet because you want to know how. T- to, like, follow some type of puzzle, like, there, there's no, there's no right or wrong way to do this okay you just have to do it you just have to do it with the lottery bet on yourself okay somebody's like yeah there's a need to bet on yourself and share your gifts with the world this is how and where you're going to receive this accolade or you know um there's like there's an energy here where you give to the world of your whatever your creative endeavors are. You give it, the universe is saying, give it to the rest of the world and we will repay you. And that's how you're going to um, receive this accolade or become a celebrity or whatever this is. I don't want to, because we do have celebrity here. I don't want to say this is how you're going to become a celebrity, but there's something out there for you. OK, and it has to do with being put on a pedestal or being put in some type of leadership position. You you can either go get it. But you but I feel like, you know, you may be wondering, like, but how, how, how? There's many different ways. OK, um, don't get stuck on the how. Don't get stuck on the how. I feel like you may be missing opportunities. Like there may be opportunities in front of you that you're not taking. Okay. Get a move on you guys. Get a move on. <laughs> yeah. Uh, don't lose success. Don't lose success because you're just standing there because you want control. This is it, making me feel like spirit is saying, listen, how could I, how could I make, how could I give you the answers to what's going to make you famous or what's going to catapult you into success if you're not creating a lane? There's several different things that you know how to do. There's several different things that you are creative with. There's several different ways of going about doing it. This reminds me of like lighting a candle for something but not putting in the work. <laughs> Spirit is saying like, yeah, I want to make something happen to you, but can you just plant the seed, plant the seed, plant the seed and I will, and I will help it to grow. devil card caught my attention in the middle of the deck <laughs> okay it looks like somebody is maybe trying to hold you back from something okay hold you back from this we always get this right it's like somebody who knows what you stand to be is trying to hold you back so just think about um the the different ways that you may be contributing um into this blockage that someone's trying to create for you, like not um, taking action or executing ideas or being indecisive, right? Think about how um, you are allowing for this energy to block you. What is it that you're doing? Yeah. See with the physical act, physical activity and follow your dreams. Physical activity and follow your dreams. That's what I'm saying. Are you are you working? Are you are you putting your all into this? Whatever this is. This is some big shit though. Because we got the star card out here and celebrity plus this energy of the honoring path. This it feels to me like there's gonna be a lot of self discipline needed to to go grab this. All right, there's gonna be a lot of self discipline needed to go grab this. Don't 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 pass this up. Do what you gotta do, you guys. Yeah. Oh, 
karmic completion and time out is here. Yeah, keep make sure that you are. Yeah. See what this you see this um like break free of these chains, whatever it is, because somebody with the projections and clinging to the past, it seems like somebody is trying to make you hold on to some sort of energy of the past. It could be um with this ace of swords here having to do with your mind. Like I said, because it's a lot of confusion. I feel the energy of distractions as well. You really need to break out of this in order to have a rebirth. Somebody uh, needs to unplug. Unplug from everything and everybody and go get your blessings. Whatever this is, it's, it's there for you. You got to go get it. Yeah, there's a lot of back and forth in your energy. A lot of back and forth. Go get go get your blessings. With that abundance energy there and then the rejection, it's like it's like the money is there or the fame is there or the opportunities are there, but you're not putting yourself out there to go catch it is what it feel like. Some, some of you guys may be in some sort of victim mentality, all right? But I feel like the, the, the time is right for you to go. Okay, somebody may be feeling like, yeah, but this, you know, there's people that's trying to stop me and they hating on me. And, and, and yeah, I see that it's right here with the devil card. But that th you have to move. Okay, cut. I just heard cut the ties that bind, cut the ties that bind, cut the ties that bind. Somebody may be getting comfortable in their chains. And it's like, no, I feel like I feel like you got to go ahead, go get it. Raphael helps you heal in mind, body, and spirit. Raphael helps you heal in, in mind, mind, body, and spirit. Somebody may need to work with Archangel Raphael. Your loved ones in heaven want you to know that they are safe, protected, and reunited with family and friends is another message. New beginnings. Something new begins today. Embrace the possibilities. See, this is this is this is that energy that I'm speaking about. Embracing the possibilities. Go get your blessings. Okay. Um, there's more than one way. Somebody needs to use their empathic and psychic abilities to grab these um messages of forward movement, how you're gonna move forward. Yeah, because it, it looks like there's no action um, being taken, okay? Spirit wants you in this energy right here and wants you to stay in this energy he, uh, here. Um, having it all, this is my bad bitch card, right? Having it all, not needing anybody for anything, being and staying very independent, beautiful, and self-sufficient, right? But it looks like you got work to do and you're stalling, Okay. Flush away all that no longer serves you. Flush away all that no longer serves you. Yeah. There's things holding you back. I feel like, and this has been coming up in the uh, collective messages as well. All right. Anxieties and things about the past. I feel like you need to create out of the sadness or out of the trauma, you guys. Um, and I hope that helped you.